You're a genius. Thank you. But you're here to do gardening fact or fiction with us, and where do we begin on that? Well, the truth is more and more people want to get outside. They're starting to grow their own vegetables. You know, they really want to be in the yard, and we're seeing those stats way bigger than ever before. So let's start with something fun, because most people get it wrong, all right? Okay. So let's start with, should you be watering on a hot, sunny day? Should you be watering your grass, your plants, when it's super sunny outside? True or false? I think that's absolutely false. You should not be watering on a yeah. hot, sunny day. And you're absolutely wrong. That was That's a, a big myth. That was a big myth. So we're not burning our so grass. So here's why people thought that. Yeah, so okay. you see on this little plant leaf here, we've got some water, and it's kind of pooled and made water droplets. And everybody thought, oh, that, you know, the sun is going to reflect through that and burn like the plant. a magnifying glass. Doesn't happen. The plants are actually designed to handle that. I mean, think about how often it rains and then the sun comes out. So why are we told not to water myth. our lawn? It's a waste of water. Total it evaporates. Myth. It Total is myth. a waste of water if you're doing the, the sprinklers that look like this, because okay. the water will evaporate faster. But if your plants are dry, water. water them. Your plants, okay. absolutely. All, All right. right. So what's up next? We're gonna talk pots. Where are we at? Where are we at? Show us our okay. next question. Let's, oh, let's go organic pesticides. pesticides. Okay. All right. Organic pesticides. Are these a less toxic option for pets and for kids? Well, I hope so. Uh, you're so, 0 for 2 right oh now. 0 for 2. Well, you bring good information. <laughs> yeah, so you hear the buzzer? You pesticides buzz. of any type. Pesticides type, of good. any type, you have to follow the directions. It's so important. Just because it says organic doesn't mean you should spray more. Most of these are made with chrysanthemum. Now, chrysanthemum is actually really toxic even though it's a plant. Right. So, read the directions. Don't go spraying crazy and thinking, oh, I'm, I'm doing it's okay because it's organic. I think this is the first time that I'm super happy to be wrong. Yay, 0 for 2. I'm learning. You're learning with me here? Okay. <laughs> uh, plastic pots or clay pots? Okay. Is pl are plastic pots better for you in the garden than clay? Are plastic pots better than clay pots for containing in the garden? False. <sighs> You're 0 for 3. Plastic pots are better? Plastic pots are better. Well, and that's so good because I just bought some <laughs> that's Here's pots. why. Clay okay. pots, we always thought clay pots were really good at absorbing moisture and they'd hold it for the plant. And you can see the clay pot will actually suck all that water right in. But what happens is it's drying out your plants. It sucks all the water out of sucks the soil. sucks all the Isn't water that? out of the soil. So plastic pots are better and 9 times out of 10 they're made of recycled materials. And when you're done, you can usually recycle these again. So plastic, definitely a better option than clay. Woohoo! This is fun. All right, let's talk. I've, I've never felt so right being so wrong. <laughs> let's talk batteries. Okay, batteries. Battery powered tools. A okay. lot of research coming into battery powered tools right now, especially the battery packs themselves. Are these tools better for you than gas as far as the environmental impact? I'm going to say no. Uh, you're O for what's that for now? I don't now? know. Just call me wrong, wrong, wrong. You okay, have so to you have to look for the little Everybody symbol that looks like lithium. that. Yeah, you have to look for the little symbol like that. It's a recyclable battery. Okay. So what that means is all the components of this battery can take be taken apart and reused, and that's so important because now it's staying out of the landfill. So and you can There's also use key. tools like this and the batteries in multiple different tools. So it's interchangeable. Much better than gas. Gas in the environment, awful. Yeah, awful, I hate awful. A leaf blower, Especially, I gotta tell you. Uh oh. I don't like the gas. Powered leaf good. Well, that's a good answer because batteries are much better option. Now's the time to buy a new one. All right, let's have some fun. Okay. Beer. 30 seconds. Let's. Oh, beer. Beer. We, we got to end on beer. Beer is good trap to catch slugs in a garden. True or false? I'm going to go true. <laughs> I'm wrong, wrong, wrong. Well, slugs. I just want to drink the beer, really. <laughs> good for the gardener, not good for the garden. Okay. Slugs do like beer, but what they've shown as research is if you put beer traps in your garden, you pull all the slugs from your neighbor's yards into your space. So you actually increase the volume of slugs in your space. Don't use Don't slug use traps. Don't use beer. I've never used a slug trap, I gotta say. Do you have a tip on fruit flies? Uh, yeah, I do, actually. Tell me. Put saran wrap over the top of the bowl with a little red wine on the bottom, punch some holes, you're done. Deal. What, what, what's this here for? Oh, I think we're going to give it away. Okay. 